Welcome to LP High School, home of the Cavaliers and the core of our community for the last 100 years. At LP, the mission is to ensure that all students are inspired to become lifelong learners who can think critically, solve problems, and communicate effectively, and who have pride and respect in themselves and the community. So basically, that's a fancy way of saying we have a great school filled with teachers and staffers who are doing everything possible for everyone who enters LP and plans on leaving four years later to go into college, a job, or the military. And trust me, I should know, I spent the last four amazing years here. It wasn't easy as first. I came from Oglesby, Washington, a pretty small school, into this huge, large school that was filled with seniors who looked like giants. I was completely scared of my wits, but don't worry, it gets better. I survived and I can tell you things that have only gotten better as the years go on. And now I have a few pointers for you so you can get the best out of your Cavalier experience. So, when you first show up at LP, it might seem like a scary place, especially if you come from a small junior high, but you'll soon learn that it's actually pretty easy to get around. The main building is basically a big E shape, and each section of the E is a different department. So let's take a look. The starting on the first floor, which is the lowest level of the building, the top of the E is the math wing. The middle is where the foreign language classes are, and the bottom are social science classes. If you're in band or choir, you'll be spending a lot of time in this section way down here. On the main floor, the top of the E is the administrative offices and the counseling office. The bookstore is also located here. That's where you can pick up last minute supplies and it's the LP lost and found. In the middle is the library and the bottom has art, health, and special education classes. The cafeterias are here and here. We'll be talking more about that in a few seconds. And if you don't know where Select Gym is, it's right here. Up on the third floor, the top is English, the middle is the business wing, and the bottom has science classes. There are also more science classrooms over here. If you take a family and consumer science class, those are right here along the side of the E. In between classes, you'll have five minutes to get from one class to the next. It might not seem like a lot of time, but trust me, it's plenty. I've been able to go to the bottom, to the top, and back to the bottom easily before. Anything's possible in the five minute amount of time. Speaking of the time between classes, you're probably wondering what an average day is here like at LP. Well, an average day starts at 7.45 in the morning, and throughout the day you have seven periods, each consisting of 55 minutes. During fifth hour, you'll have your lunch period, and this is also the period that never gets shortened. On every day but Wednesday, we get out at 2.40, but on Wednesdays, we get out at 1.46. So lunch here at LP is a little different than any other place. We have four lunch lines. One is the potato and salad line that also offers soup. Second is the main lunch line that changes every day, except Thursdays are pasta day, which is very popular here at LP. The next line is the a la carte line, where you can get chips and salsas, regular chips, PB&Js, or pretzels. And then we have another lunch line where on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays we offer pizza. We offer cheese, pepperoni, veggie, or Hawaiian. And then Tuesdays and Fridays are nacho grande day. One thing to remember about lunch is you always need to bring your ID or have a day pass. They will not allow you to have food if you don't bring your ID because it's the way that they scan your money. And in the lunch periods, you have two options to sit. You can either sit in the new cafeteria or the old cafeteria. It's up to you where you want to sit in the lunch cafeterias, but it doesn't matter because they both have great atmospheres. Alright, so here at LP, you can check your grades or your parents can check your grades. It doesn't matter. But if you want to check your grades, all you have to do is go to the Power School option on the website. First, your username is your ID number and then your password would be your birthday. For parents, it's a little different. Usually you have to sign up and the school will give you your parent username and password. LP provides a lot of information for you and your students to go check out. 
We have the school website which provides a school calendar where you can go and see the dates and times for sporting events, club activities, and anything else happening here at LP. We also have daily announcements that are read at the beginning of every morning here at LP. Here your students will be able to find the different times for the club meetings and everything going on, the practices that they may have after school, and the lunch menu. LP also has a Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram page. Here you will be updated on everything going on at LP and what fun things are happening. Thanks Parker, that's some great advice for an LP student. And speaking of great advice, we went out and spoke to some LP teachers and students to hear the top tips to succeed here at LP. Here are the top five. The first key to success is attendance. It might seem obvious, but you need to come to class. Learning the material is a lot easier if you actually show up. to do your work. Again, it seems like a no-brainer, but you do a lot better in school when you have your schoolwork done. Whether it's a small homework assignment or a big end of your project, do your work. It'll pay off. The third thing is to bring your materials to class every day. That includes your Chromebook. You can't succeed in the football field without your helmet, and likewise, you can't succeed in the classroom without bringing your supplies. So make sure to bring everything you need for class. That's including your Chromebook, which you'll receive at registration. Don't be afraid to take a chance and try new things, whether it's picking up a tennis racket for the first time or checking out the debate club. There are so many opportunities here, and make sure you take advantage of them. The fifth thing is to get help early. If you feel like you're falling behind in a class or having problems fitting in, don't give up. There are some great opportunities to get help here at LP. Mr. Duffy in the counseling office is going to share some of them with you right now. One of the best parts about being a student at LP is that there are so many people willing to help you get the grades that you want. We have tutors on site before school and after school. They're available to help you in any of your subjects. If you want a little extra help in math, we have Math Lab in the morning with one of our LP math teachers. We also have Math Lab every hour throughout the day. So if you have a study hall and you wanted to get extra help or get some of your work done in math, you can go right to Math Lab during your study hall period. We have our Reading and Writing Lab with an LP English teacher before school to help you get some of your papers and writing assignments done. And we also have Tech Labs, two in the morning, one in the afternoon, if you wanted to work on info processing or anything else on the computer. So whether you're looking for a little bit of extra help to get your grades up, or if you just want a peaceful place to work, we've got you covered. And as always, if you ever had questions about any of the resources available at LP or any of your specific classes, or if you need to help on anything at all, you can always come down and speak to the counselors in the counseling office. We're here to help you with anything that you need. I hope this helped. And remember, take advantage of everything LP has to offer. Get involved and enjoy your four years here at LP. And welcome to the Cavalier community.